drug addicts, you know what I'm saying? And those people are still good people at the end of the day, regardless if they have to do all kind of crazy shit to get their drugs. That's not them, that's the drugs that took over. So help someone get sober. Seems like my life been really changing on me. I know some niggas out here hating on me. Hey, I see the bitches how they changing on me. I know some niggas out here snaking on me. Hey, she like my What's the goddamn deal, people? I right, so it's your boy, your boy back, you know what I'm saying? Two days in a row. Everybody gonna be like, damn nigga, two days in a row, you must be in a good mood. <laughs> but yeah, I appreciate everybody who checked out the videos yesterday. Appreciate everybody who shared it. If you haven't checked it out, if you haven't shared it or liked it or whatever, please do so, so everybody can see the video. And then we can all just have a good god darn time, and everybody can enjoy Twig and enjoy my mind, Frank, because my mind is is good. It's out there, you know. What I'm saying I'm trying to put everybody up on game, and I didn't go to school for none of this. I just looked at life and just realized, you know, I was a smart dude since birth. You know what I'm saying? But I ain't trying to take it off of myself. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> no, I'm just playing. And shout out to everybody, comment, man, tell me how the world would be a better place if I was, you know, more people like me and they're ready to fight with me and everything else. We do need to come together, you know what I'm saying? We have to come together. That's the only way we're going to make it in this world. But shit, we got to get into some Jelly Rolls Sober. And then the next video I'm going to do is going to be my cousin's video. So I need y'all to tune in and check him out too, please. But anyways, sober. Am I sober? What would you like to know? <laughs> but nah. Let's get into it. I can't really speak on it right now because, you know, I don't know what the music's going to be about. But before we do that, y'all like, comment, subscribe, share to everybody. Let everybody know about your boy. We almost at 6,000. Man, I only need 201 more people, man, to get to 6,000. And then once we get there, it's going to go 7,000, 8,000, 9,000, 10,000. I'm really trying to get to 10,000, you know what I'm saying? Once I get to 10,000, I'm thinking my subscribers and everything will start going up because YouTube will like, oh, well, he really doing this thing, you know what I'm saying? But let's stop talking because a lot of people be getting mad. Oh, you talk too much. You say too much. Well, what the fuck you think a reaction is. I'm not just supposed to just listen to something to say stupid little things for two seconds and then be done. Nah, that's not what I do. I'm real. You know what I'm saying? But let's go ahead and get to... Oh, shit. I'm always fucking up, boy. At least y'all know my reactions is real. I ain't on no dumb shit. But let's go ahead and get into Jelly Rolls sober. Hope y'all are sober. I like hearing burning sounds. Let me know if the audio's better. It should be better now. Up this morning a little hungover. Man, I did the other night. After I beat that dude up, I woke up hungover. I don't really get hungover, but you can still feel a little bit. People were like, well, that's hungover. Well, you know, I ain't never really just been like sick. I drink a lot, I don't really get sick, you know what I'm saying? It's just <coughs> a little, little rousal dowsy, you know what I'm talking about? <laughs> it hits different since I got older. It do hit different when you get older and drink it. Side of me will never get sober. I know, it just sucks too. Try to know my pain, but the bullshit never works. Bullshit, I'll never stop. Never wind, whatever you said. Let me rewind it because I don't know if we said wine or stop, whatever you said. Hold on. Try to know my pain, but the bullshit never works. Oh, the bullshit never works. Is that what he said? I think he said never works. Try to numb my pain. We all try to numb my pain with doing shit. You know what I'm saying? I ain't never done nothing besides smoke weed and drink. You know what I mean? And did salvia one time, but it really didn't work on me. But yeah, there's a lot of people out here that needs to be sober, or would like to be sober, or it's close to try to get to sober. You know what I'm saying? And I just hope that everybody can be sober when they need when they need to be. You know what I'm saying? Because you can't make nobody do something that they don't want to do, and that's what we all try to do. We all want everybody else to stop doing some shit. But if you're not in their shoes, if you've never been a drug addict, like I've never been a drug addict, so I can't speak on people who are on drugs because I ain't never lived that life. You know what I'm saying? I could talk about alcoholics because I've been an alcoholic before, you know what I'm saying? And I could talk about weed head because I've been a motherfucking weed head too. But there's times, you know, there's times like right now, I don't really smoke weed like that no more. I probably ain't smoked shit in pff, weeks. Maybe in a month, a couple months, you know what I'm saying? I already don't smoke, I don't buy weed, none of that shit. If somebody has some weed, I'll probably hit it a couple times. That's about it. But as far as me buying it, no. But the liquor and the alcohol, that's my little downfall right there. I need to stop doing that shit. I need to stop drinking. I do need to get sober when it comes to, you know, drinking beer and shit. I love Budweiser. I already drink alcohol unless somebody else buys it. So I don't really buy alcohol like that. I, every now and then I buy some, you know what I'm saying? But 
Sober sometimes is the most of the time, people are gonna say all the time is the best way to be, but sometimes we do need to get fucked up though, sometimes, you know what I'm saying? Nigga wanna come home from a hard day at work and just wanna have a beer, drink you a beer, bro. As long as you ain't getting fucked up every goddamn day, get blacking out, getting drunk and shit, you good. But let me stop talking for y'all, get mad. No, I'm just playing with y'all. I run from shame, I'll do anything to heal the hurt. That shit sucks, cause a lot of people do that shit. It's hard to find closure. It took me a while, which I really still ain't found closure when my daughter passed away, you know what I'm saying? I kind of made me drink a lot more too, you know what I'm saying? But we all hide behind a lot of shit. We hide behind our sins, we hide behind these cameras, we hide behind closed doors, we hide behind everything. And it's not, you know, that we shouldn't be hiding from nothing. We should just really just be out and open and take care of our minds, take care of our bodies and our souls. Because at the end of the day, when everything is, when you're gone, you're gone, people. You know what I'm saying? When you're dead and gone, you're dead and gone. You can't come back. It doesn't matter no more about you. People are gonna think about you, of course, but you're dead and gone. People still gotta move on. So, it makes sense that if you do have any fucked up problems where you're strung out on anything, try to get help. And for us that are around people who ask for help, listen to them, man. Yeah, they clucks and they'll steal some shit and steal your shit and everything else. That's part of the game. We gotta understand that that's part of the game. That's how people react. That's how people act when they're strung out on some shit like that. You know what I'm saying? But it don't hurt to help people, man. It really don't hurt to help somebody. Regardless if you feel like they're gonna be this, they're gonna do this to you, they're gonna just go take the money, go get more drugs. Like, man, help them still, bro. You have to be strong with people because people aren't strong for themselves. I ain't put down a shirt, man. You gotta be strong for people because people aren't strong on themselves. They're really not. It's hard. Life is hard, man. We all know that shit. Life is hard, but life is, they'll say the saying is life is what you make it. But look what life makes it for us. You know what I'm saying? When you got the government, you got people, you got dumbass shit, you got weather, you got all this extra shit, man. It's like, how can you maneuver through it? You gotta have this stuff. If you ain't got your mind, you ain't got nothing. You can have a heart all day and every day. But if your mind ain't straight, it's, just, it's over with. The heart ain't even gonna matter no more. Dr. Twig. You got to Jelly Roll, hold it down, man. You gotta hold it down, man. Sucks. It's hard to do with a lot of pain I go through. It's hard to go through a lot of pain that I go through. You know what I'm saying? I'm a very strong individual. And I'm always happy no matter what. Here lately, I've been feeling lonely like a motherfucker. Though, man, I got so lonely last night. I was sitting, laying in the middle of my goddamn floor, just looking at this, and I'm like, God damn, I wish I had somebody here with me. When my kids ain't here with me, I'm lonely than a motherfucker. And I drink. I don't like being in the house, you know what I'm saying? I like to be outside, because I like to be, you know, out in nature or just outside, period, because I hate being in the house. Mine starts thinking everything else, you know what I'm saying? I'm not perfect. None of us is perfect, you know what I'm saying? But shit. Try to be sober as much as you can, even though I'm drinking a beer right now. <laughs> I still gotta try to be sober though. Ask smiles. Let me rewind that say. I just have behind a mask of smiles. We all do that shit. When I'm down and drunk and bound, I get as high as I can be. Yeah, it's crazy when you're down you get as high as you can. I don't like the person that's inside of me. Hell no. Try to numb my pain, but the bullshit never works. Never works. Bullshit never works. We all try to numb our pain, man. It's it's hard to numb it. Especially when you lose a child or you lose a close family member. Like, it's hard to fucking numb shit. You know what I'm saying? It's hard just to have a clear mind or not want to drink, not want to get fucked up. You know what I'm saying? Not want to just go crazy. It's hard, but as long as you try to hold it down, man, and keep that healthy head and that healthy mind, which is the same thing, and keep your eyes clear, it, it'll work out for us, you know what I'm saying? We don't realize that all we gotta do is just work a little harder than what we're doing for things to work out, you know what I'm saying? It's hard for a lot of people to stop drinking and stop doing drugs and shit. I've never done like hard drugs, just weed, that was it. But alcohol, I can 
quit any day I want to. It's easy for me. No matter how bad I drink or whatever, if I wake up and be like, I'm done, I'm done. You know what I'm saying? These motherfuckers right here, these one I need to stop. Which I can stop these too, but man, goddamn, boy, they be stressing me. I be needing that goddamn black of my cream, man. I really do, because niggas be stressing me, though. Fuck out. We got some snitches around here, too. If you, if, you, if you my neighbors and you watch this video and you snitching, bitch, I got my eyes on y'all. <laughs> I know that ain't got nothing to do with the video. I just had to put that out there. I'm tired of everybody snitching. I'm some dumb shit. We party every fucking day, basically. We barbecue every goddamn day. We just try to live our life. We drink and shit, you know what I'm saying? We play music and shit. We try to live our life. But people are in everybody else's business because they think they can just do that shit. Nah, man. Stay out my goddamn business. Now, I know that ain't got nothing to do with the video, but I had to put that out there. I'll run from shame, I'll do anything to heal the hurt Anything Well, what you done doing? Why you trying to burn the shit down? You burn the money? You burn the money, man For real Gotta learn to fucking swallow your pride. Gotta learn to do all types of shit different, man. At the end of the day, people, if, I need, if I'm the one that you need to talk to, if you need to talk to anybody anything, if you don't know how to stop doing this or anything, bro, my doors are always up. Well, I can't say my door because a lot of crazy ass people out there. <laughs> but my phone line is always up. And my, my Instagram is John Marsh. Y'all know it's going to be on the screen. You know what I mean? Hit me up and talk to me. I love talking to different random people. I love people. There's a lot of good people in this world, no matter what race they are. I just love talking to people. If you are hooked on anything, I ain't no doctor for shit. I'm Dr. Twigger, you know what I'm saying? In my own mind, I will talk to anybody. I promise you that. Y'all hit me up on my social media for real. There's people who do hit me, and I appreciate that for y'all. I appreciate that from y'all. Gotta have that change, man. Oh, they get sober. Woke up this morning a little hungover. Shout out to Jelly, man. Shout out to the row. Really though, man, like, there's some people who really do need to be sober. You know what I'm saying? Like, sober as fuck because there's people out here doing meth heads and crack heads. I don't even think they got crack anymore, but drug addicts, you know what I'm saying? And some people are still good people at the end of the day, regardless if they have to do all kind of crazy shit to get their drugs. That's not them, that's the drugs that took over. So help someone get sober, you know what I mean? If you're not sober and you need help, like I said, hit me up. If if you know somebody that wants that needs talking, let them know about me. I for sure talk to them, I do not care. Especially if you're in Texas and you're close to Houston, I'm game, you know what I'm saying? I'm game to pull up and meet you and talk to anybody, you know what I'm saying? But just hit me up, man, just listen. I appreciate Jelly for what he does. I appreciate a lot of these people that do music because, you know, there's a lot of good music out here. There's a lot of stupid ass music too, but there's a lot of good music if you just listen to the words and understand where people are coming from because all these songs are helping anybody. You know what I'm saying? If you're going through what the same thing they're going through, it's all helpful. But at the end of the day, keep your mind clear, keep your eyes clear, and take care of your body, your soul. I love y'all, man. Shout out.